there is a, a strong value about it, the, the, the idea of repair that's it's an introduction into into craftsmanship it's a way to develop uh, skills to to find yourself into a problem situation that you have to come up with a solution so I believe that uh, repair is a very subtle way into a, a creative activity the whole idea of repair started probably when I was around 10 years old I used to play with GI Joes and uh, they, they had a common problem that uh, their thumbs they have their hands in this shape and their thumbs, they're always breaking, so they couldn't uh, hold their guns anymore. So uh, I came up with the idea, well, I'll just start repairing with uh, aluminum foil and scissors and kind of materials that I could find around. My father is a doctor, my mother is a biologist, but they have this hobby of sculpting and uh, making models like sheep models. I grew up having access to workshop, to having a tool in my hands and craftsmanship is not much of a, something I decide to do, it's something that happened with me, something that uh, became part of who I am. The idea of the project is it's to try to find a way to, to deal with frustration, the frustration that we find in, in a broken object. Uh, that doesn't deliver the, the functionality of it. But I was quite intrigued about the about other things, other broken things, like the financial crisis, like the problems in, in a bigger system uh, as a society. Everything is kind of out of control. That you're trying to control, but you cannot. Uh, and completely opposed to that, there's the idea of, of craftsmanship, in a sense. You have full control over what you're doing. You have the piece of material in your hands. You imagine the shape that you want. You use the machine to achieve what you want. And, uh, and you're obsessed about it. Uh, I see craftsmanship as a big obsession in a good way. I imagine a, a, this kind of shape, so I go and cut the wood and, and, and I sand and polish and apply all these techniques and all of that. So there's this whole idea of the man controlling your environment. So I don't hide the problem in the object, but uh, I create so many solutions. This piece that, I, that I, I bought on eBay for 10 pounds, it's a broken angle poise. When I bought it, this part that uh, it's connected in this part over here on the, on the shade, it was broken. So the, the basic functionality of, of this piece is to uh, to move up and down and to spin as well the, the, the shade. But uh, well, that's, that's the repair that I'm working on. So I apply the use of craftsmanship. So I develop a, a huge, complex, shiny, uh, new solution. But uh, so I reproduce the same up and down movement now with, uh, with this kind of movement. And, uh, and there is a new lock that spins and uh, so there, there is all this complication that uh, I apply all the craftsmanship to, to create these these kind of solutions. Well, I will be presenting six pieces. They are all found uh, broken objects uh, from around. They are all repaired in the same applying the same methodology. Yeah, and I don't know exactly how people will receive that. I will put over there something that comes from our everyday life, like lamps, iPod. There's going to be a chair that uh, is repaired using as an inspiration, a visual inspiration, uh, suspension bridges with like, hundreds of tiny cables. And there is the iPod that I repair using spare ribs from a meal that I had at the university. So like, there's this big clash of technology and, and something quite uh, primitive as bones. It is a, an amazing opportunity, something incredible to, to present your work to a, a high profile kind of exhibition and, and audience as well. And uh, the nice thing about this, uh, to, to participate and collect, is that uh, I'm right now in, in Sao Paulo, I, I'm exactly in the, in the house where I grew up, I, I was born over here. And, uh, 20 years ago, I was repairing my GI Joes, and 20 years later, I'm, I'm still repairing new things, but now displaying them at, at Collect. So 
it, there is a, this uh, sense of closing, kind of closing a circle of, of achieving something that uh, it's quite a, uh, an epic story in a sense and a sense of achievement, uh, personal achievement as well.